Welcome back. I'm Monica from LA Parks. Today, I'm with Channel 35 and I'll be teaching chair circuit. What you'll need is a sturdy chair, a light set of dumbbells, a resistance loop band, water and a towel. Let's get started with the march in place. Light on the feet here. When you're ready, ready. Do not forget to like and share today's workout on Facebook. Now utilizing your dumbbells today. If you have more than one set, bring them on out. If you are limited with equipment today, that's perfectly fine. You can use canned goods, water bottles that are filled for resistance. Deep and hull up. Exhale, push out, release. Two more just like that. Breathe and lengthen. Exhale, same thing with that band. Last one here, we're gonna go right as that step touch. Push out, release, arms forward and back. The resistance band is encouraged completely optional. Yes, at times where maybe you may feel a little tired, fatigued, or you may not have access to one. So you'll still mimic the movement without that band. We're going to do a toe tap, reaching towards the floor, coming up towards the sky, arms coming straight up right here, toes knees forward, high five. Lengthen and reach, taking your time here. Do your best to keep your legs as straight as possible. Breathing into the nose. Excellent to the mouth. Neutral flat back. Pull the stretch of the hamstrings, lower back, all while engaging your abs. A few more here. You got it, come on. Knees up, opening up those hips. Shake it out. Right here. For every knee, you want to exhale through the mouth. Opening up those hips. We're going to switch it up. Focus on one side. Bring it at a diagonal here. Right here on four. Three, you're going to pick any side. Last two. Pick a side, drive that knee up, four eights. And switch. Shake it out if you need to in between, just eight reps. Heel to butt, hamstring curls. This time, we're gonna bring our arms back, squeezing the upper back, tricep shoulder blades here. Strong arms as you open up. Proud chest. Try not to slouch here. Singles right here, right, left. We're gonna switch it up. Instead of singles, you're gonna give me doubles. Two on the right, two on the left. Let's get right into it. Doubles right here. 30 seconds, and then we'll begin our workout. Shoulders relax, roll back. Taking your time, working off time versus reps. Staying hydrated. You got it, last you here. Really squeeze the back of those legs. Good job, shake it out. Look at those fingers, toes when you're ready, ready. Carefully have a seat. Seated march. We're gonna switch up the counts. We're gonna march to three. Swoop up hamstrings. March to three. Hamstrings. March to three. Hamstrings. So you are alternating on three so that you are switching leads. Breathing into the nose. Exhale as you come up. Last four. Here's four. Three. Here's two. One more. Good job when you're ready, ready. Grab a hold on to your lighter set of weights. 
That's if you have options today. Otherwise, you're gonna stay consistent with what you have. Any of the movements, you can always adjust depending on the exercise. Instead of using two weights, you'll be using one. So palms facing each other here. Shoulders relaxed and roll back. Bring your arms towards me and you're just gonna alternate here. Upper body focus, chest, shoulders, and back. You definitely wanna bend at the elbows. We're gonna go in here quick in and out. We'll be for 30 seconds. I am looking for controlled movement. Breathing into the nose. Exhale, center here. You got it. Alternating when we come back to this movement. These are upright flies. We'll incorporate both arms at the same time. Last time, left arm and right. Good job. All right, when you're ready, ready. Decide on this next movement if you'll be using both weights or just one. Quick demonstration. You might be feeling extra strong where you are probably good using both. You're gonna keep that weight at chest level. Walk your legs feet forward so that your knee and ankle are aligned. Yes, you're gonna come up. Carefully have a seat. Breathing into the nose. Exhale as you stand up straight. Natural slight bend in those knees. Quick in and out. Once again, we'll be here for about 30 seconds. So today's focus goal is a minute a piece. We'll be doing a minute of resistance training and about a minute of cardiovascular training. Utilizing your own body weight and your resistance, your dumbbells, canned goods, water bottles, and that loop band. Give me three more reps here. Standing up nice and strong, control here. Good job when you're ready, ready. Sitting all the way back, placing the other weight, if not both, underneath that chair or completely off to the side out of your way. All right, we're going to add a little bit of coordination, similar to what we did earlier with the knee strikes and hamstring curls, right? So we're going to go into that side tap reach one time, side tap reach other side, and then we're going to double up. So single, single, double up. All right, with this movement, you definitely can stand up if you'd like. Otherwise, please remain seated with me. So we're gonna be here for about one minute. Let's go. Have fun with those obliques. Shifting your upper body over, yes. It's a toe tap. The beauty of time is that you are going to move at your own pace. Can you speed it up? Maybe for just a few reps, a few seconds, and then you can slow it down. Looking good. Come on. 10 seconds. Last time here. Good job. All right, shake it out. Arms and legs. Feel free to hydrate. Towel off if you need to. We're gonna grab a hold onto that resistance loop band. We're gonna place it onto our feet. From here, you're gonna kick your legs feet forward. We're gonna focus on one side. We're gonna alternate now. So join me when you're ready, ready. Scoot forward just a tad if you can on that chair. Lean back as you drive your knees up. Give me about 10 more seconds here. Alternate with me. In other words, this gives you that grace period to adjust your band. Yes, to get acquainted with the movement. And then we're gonna focus and isolate one side. Or once again, we're gonna aim for 30 seconds right here. Let's start with that left leg. Drive that knee up and return. 
upper body almost still. You can lean back a little bit more or you can move with the movements. Knee up, lean back. Utilizing that chair, the armrest. Nice, comfortable grip as you pull back and drive those knees up. Hips, abs, a little bit of mobility work here, yes. Work against this resistance. Yes, on that return. Control, yes. Last one here, give me one more. And switch, opposite leg. Let's take it to the right. Yes, exhaling as you drive that knee up. A little bit of isolation here. We're gonna go right back to cardio, solid minutes. And then we'll switch it back up, utilizing those dumbbells. Last few here. Here's three, two, and time. Good job, carefully release. Taking that band once again out of your way. All right, right back to cardio. We're gonna switch it up. We're gonna keep the same footwork. Toe tap, you can even stomp if you like. So you have some flexibility, some options. This time your arm comes across the body chest. We're gonna still stay consistent, single, single, double. Toe tap or a gentle stop. More oblique work. Shift your upper body, yes. Solid minute. Let's go. You hear the music? You can play on that. Stay on the beats. Or move just a little bit quicker. Yes, cardio based. You want to kick up that intensity. Come on. Yes, this movement, you can definitely stand up. You got it. Last 20 seconds. Come on. Get ready for those dumbbells. Last time, each side. Come on. Good job. Take that short break breather if you need it. Shake it out. Towel off, hydrate. Cheers. All right, so this is where you can actually have a little bit of play. If you have maybe a heavier set of dumbbells, you can use one. We're gonna work that squat to press. Press, tapping working our shoulders. We're gonna alternate and then we're going to focus on one side. Similar to what we did a moment ago with that band. Isolation, focusing on one side. So right now, join me when you're ready, ready. You're gonna come all the way up. Rock that shoulder press. Hand switch, yes. Rock that shoulder press. Hand switch. So how can you split this workout? You can remain seated. Yes. Or maybe you can't lift that arm today. Yes. Continue with the squats. Flex your options. Last few seconds, continue to alternate. We're gonna focus on one side. Looking good. All right, right here. Right side only. Use that chair, that armrest if you need to, right, just to come up. Same deal, legs kicked forward just a little bit. Your knees, ankles are aligned. You hinge from the hips, come all the way up. Come all the way down. You can gently tap your quad or keep that weight up at about chest level. Last few seconds, we're gonna switch to that left arm.
other side. Take that short break breather. Otherwise, let's get right into it here. Gentle tap. Or not. Best of both worlds. Legs, shoulders, your core, abs, is all factored into this move. Predominantly legs and shoulders right here. Control as you lower. Little power at the top. Last three reps. You got it, come on. And time. Good job. Once again, take that weight completely out of your way. Off to the side or underneath your chair. All right, we're going to switch out that cardio move completely. Ideal, if you can, reach down with both hands. Legs slide in. You're going to open up. So this does require a little bit of coordination. Coming down with both hands. All the way up, palms facing me, dropping those shoulders. So you come down, slide in and out right here. Come on. Solid minute. Neutral flat back. Your chest is still lifted here. Reach, open up. You can slide your legs, you can lift. Gonna go right back to that resistance band. Get ready, ready. Less than 20 seconds. Last one here. Good job. Shake it out, arms and legs when you're ready, ready. Grab a hold on to that resistance loop band. This time we're gonna place that band around our ankles. All right, we're gonna have fun with this one. We're going to step out, step out, alternate, and then bring both legs out and in at the same time. Switch. Opposite leg, left leg, step out, step out, both legs at the same time, and switch back to that right lead, step out, step out, both legs at the same time. Controlled movement, once again, moving at your own pace. This is for time, so give me about 30 seconds here. Bonus points. As you are alternating, think about stepping in to the floor to really engage those leg muscles. You're gonna feel the glutes a little bit more as you press into the floor with your feet. Come on. Big difference. Give it a try. Step into it. Pushing off toes and heels. Looking good, wrapping up here. Good job, when you're ready, ready. We're gonna switch it up. We're gonna walk our toes out, walk our heels out, walk it back in. So it's going to be a heel, toe, heel, toe. Reverse it, yes. Taking your time, so we are what? Strengthening what? Can anyone tell me? This could be definitely a challenge here, yes? Ankle mobility. Once again, moving at your own pace, slow controlled movements. Take your time. Last few seconds. 
get ready, ready. We're gonna go right back to cardio and then go back to our dumbbells. Neutral flat back. Arms are just relaxing here. Last time out. Last time in. Good job. When you're ready, ready, carefully release. Removing that band. All right, we're gonna go into our quick big action. So go right back into our work. Warm up march. Yes. We're gonna switch it up. We're gonna take this march to your athletic quick feet. Very small movements, but it's quick. 30 seconds. We'll box center to the chest for about 20 seconds. Finish off with the quick feet. That should be about a minute. And then we'll grab those dumbbells again. How's your pace? Did you slow down? It's okay to take a short break, reset, speed back up. Last you here, come on. This is one of those, I should see your pace. Are we matching? Can you match my pace? Yes, all right, take that short break breather on the legs, center punch. Full extension, slight bend in the elbows. Kick it up. Let's go. And time right back to the quick feet. Yes, we're tapping into our athleticism here. All out. This is universal. Because if you haven't tried this one standing, or maybe you haven't done it in, in a while, if it's been a few months, maybe a few years, formal athletes. All right, and time. Good job, when you're ready, ready. Towel off, hydrate, grab those weights. All right, we're gonna switch it up. Scoot forward just a little bit if you need to. Our weights are in front, elbows are bent. We're gonna open up right into those slides again. We're gonna switch it up in 30 seconds, solid minutes. Breathing into the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Good job, checking in. Try to keep your wrist straight. Notice how maybe there's like a slight imbalance. Yes, check in. Reset and get right back into it. Last few seconds here. We're gonna go into rows. We're gonna hitch the hips. You could definitely stand up for this one. Your palms will be facing you. So you're here. Neutral flat back. Palms facing. Me, not you, right here. You can alternate or rock both at the same time. Similar to our cardio move, you can go right into that single, single, both arms at the same time, yes. A little bit of brain work, does the body good. Really squeezing those back muscles, squeezing those shoulder blades. Checking in, head and neck along with the spine. Try not to look up. Finish off. You have about 15 seconds. Try not to round or slouch, even though you're hinging forward. Last one to finish here. Good job. Once again, placing those weights out of your way, underneath your chair. You can stand up, you can remain seated. Last 30 seconds, look at those fingers, toes with your march. We're gonna open up those hip flexors, rock our lunge position. A Little bit of stretches with the upper body, finishing back off in our chair. Good job, arms overhead, deep and hold up. Exhale, push out, release. This time, arms across the body chest. Breathing into the nose. Exhale, give yourself a hug. Breathe in. Give yourself a hug. Good job. Shake it out. Come on up when you're ready, ready. Drop into that lunge. It could be a mini lunge, or it could be your deep lunge, right? So front leg, bend that knee. Back leg. 
Heel can come up, tuck that tailbone, or you can walk your legs in just a little bit. Adjust so that you get your calf stretch as well. Both arms or the arm that's closest to me, rolling the shoulders here, both at the same time if you can balance. Otherwise, using that arm on one side is perfectly fine. Shake it out. Other side, same fun stretch. Drop into your lunge. Back leg, heel comes up. Bend that knee, tuck that tub on under. Or bring that heel down. Calf stretch. When you're ready, opposite arm now. Once again, it's that arm that's closest to me. Rolling it back. Both, if you can balance. Good job, when you're ready, ready. You're gonna carefully release. Shake it out, look at those fingers and toes, deep and up. Exhale, fold that body in half. Relax in your head. Gently shake that head, yes, no, maybe so. Side to side. Bend those knees. Grab your hamstrings, pull up and hold. You wanna feel the stretch through your back and shoulders here. All the way up. Shake it out. We rolled back. So now we're gonna roll our shoulders forward. Right here. Breathing in. Exhale. Release. Give me four here. And then when you're ready, ready on this last one. Carefully. Have a seat. From here, you're gonna extend your right or left leg, rotate that ankle, changing directions here, point and flex. Other side, rotate circular motion here, change directions, point and flex. Free to wiggle those fingers and toes, shaking out your wrist. We're gonna go right into our album pose, right over left or left over right. Once again, this might be more than enough. You can gently press onto your thigh or fold the body in half. Carefully release. Same stretch, extend, crossing it over. Once again, this might be more than enough to get a deeper stretch, you could gently press onto your thigh or fold that body in half. We get those fingers, toes. Carefully release when you're ready, ready. Walk your legs, feet out just a little bit here. Deep and hull up. Dropping that right hand straight down. Opposite arm left here, extend, gazing up. Slowly roll up. Other side, breathe in, lengthen. Opposite hand, now your right hand comes down. Left arm up. A Little bit of rotational movement here. Carefully release. Deep inhale up. Exhale, palms facing you, pull away, chin to chest. I appreciate you all joining me today. Gentle shake. You rock.